Hi friends. I've taken a couple of weeks off of making videos. So I guess at this time I should wish you Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and Happy New Year. I hope your holidays were warm, safe, wonderful. Warm. <laughs> I know that a lot of the country has been inundated with terrible winter weather. We've even had some really cold, unusually season, un, unseasonably cold days down here in southern Arizona. Uh, even snowed for about 10 minutes. It didn't stick, of course, but, uh, just enough to make it seem like, uh, Christmas time. Yesterday we took off to a place called Kentucky Camp. Uh, my brother and sister-in-law are here visiting us in Arizona. And uh, he's got a four-wheel drive pickup, and we took that opportunity when uh, five of us could take off and ride to Kentucky Camp. So Kentucky Camp is, um, well, you'll see what Kentucky Camp is. Come on, we're going for a ride. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Well, we're going for a ride today out towards Kentucky camp, and so there's... <laughs> well, we're heading out to Gardner Canyon today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's too many people in here being silly. I'm going to have to do voiceovers because every time I turn on my camera... I'm going to Kentucky camp. Uh, my oh, southern yeah, drawl <laughs> from an Arizona. So we're turning on to Gardner Road and we're going to go check out Kentucky Camp today and maybe, maybe. another cabin. Yeehaw! What do? Sky, when you call it Sky Island. Oh. Yeah, maybe tomorrow we'll head over to the Huachuca. Oh, we're up here at the top of the hill. There's a cow over there. Yeah. Santa Rita Mountains. They're seeing if there's any bugs in the water tank. What are you looking for? And then all of the... Oh, look at you guys. It's old number 556. You had to park and walk for three tenths of a mile, 0.27, down the hill to Kentucky Camp. Arizona National Scenic Trail, Kentucky Camp Trailhead in the Coronado National Forest. Arizona Trail. This is the visitor center over here. Wow, what a porch. <laughs> Another adobe building over there. I don't know. Can, can we go in here? It says visitor center. Don't know if it's open. A 
Well, that one's not padlocked, but let's see if there's another door that's actually open. Oh, yeah. Lights on. Must be welcome. Historic photo of the barn. So Kentucky camp was a gold miners camp. Headquarters building, 1988. Hmm. Partners in preservation. Gordon Hummel and Glenn Hummel. Hmm. Headquarters building. That's the building we're in. Property of the United States. All persons are prohibited under penalty of law from committing trespass. Well, hmm. Shouldn't have left the door open and the light on. Uh, some gold pans. George McEnany, Santa Rita Water and Mining Company. It's a big mining company that came here and tried to make a go of it, if I remember my history correctly. And um, they didn't make a go of it because of the lack of water. Oh, wow. Look at this. It keeps going. It must be guest rooms. Hmm. Oh, look at here. There's people in here. People I know. Happy 100th birthday, Kentucky camp. Hmm. Oh, just figured it out. They made a cowboy boot out of barbed wire. Gold in them there mountains. The Greaterville Mining District. 1874. 37 ounce nugget of gold discovered. Yeah, I saw a picture of it on the internet. Thought I was lost, and then I ran into my brother and my son. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, a bathtub. You remember mom used to have one of these? Roger? Do you remember mom used to have one of these? Yeah. She'd iron her... Steam iron. I, I think they called it a mangler or something like that. Mangle? Small. Your grandmother had one of these. Ironed her pants with it. The wall looked like a stone of <laughs> mud. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Did you read the sign back there that said this is federal property and... Uh, trespassers will be prosecuted? No, I didn't see that. Oh, I bet you this wasn't here in 1888. Mm -hmm. Ice. No beer. Uh, this looks familiar. I think that's where I came in. These big water guns. Uh, 
Wow. Bring up the ground with splendid results. The hydraulic monitor, or giant, was one of the three nozzles used by the Santa Rita Water Mining Company for gold, and that's why they weren't successful, because they didn't have enough water to keep running these big water guns. And this was the processing house, they said, or something. Hmm. Oh, I'd like to have that. One of the big rat poops. Huh? Poops. Rat poops. Rat poops? What are you talking Oh, yeah, rat poops. Pack rats. Yep. Yep. And there's a kitchen wow. counter made out of adobe. Wow. This is a sluicing machine. Look at this, Roger. Is that a stove? I don't know where the other burns from the wood. I don't know what it is. Hmm. This is, yeah. What is this here? The importance of water. The importance of water, yeah, I've been talking about that. They didn't have enough of it was the problem. They tried hauling it with mules. There's a picture of one from Gardner Canyon. I ran into these three ladies who had just arrived to stay overnight in the cabin that you can rent. And they gave me a tour. So, oh, you got a barbecue grill? Barbecue grill. Yeah. And then your little kitchen with the refrigerator. Ooh, oh, what a cute well, refrigerator, huh? Photo. Yeah. Retro? Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's cute. And a microwave and... Yeah. I wonder, I wonder how do they get power down here? Well, that's a good question. Yeah. They have and a kitchen table. Heater. Where are you guys from? I'm, I'm from Arizona, they're from Montana. Ah. Montana, I've been watching Yellowstone. You know that one? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 No, we know that's where all the new people are from. It's, 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 it's okay if I walk yeah, in? <laughs> Oh, bunk beds? Yeah. Wow. Well, hey, 80 bucks a night, and have you used the stove? Not yet. Not yet. We just got here today. Oh, you just got here? Yeah. How long are you here? Just tonight. Just tonight. Yeah. Well, I figured out how they get power out here in the middle of nowhere. The federal government's got an unlimited budget for taking care of stuff. There's your adobe sink. That's where they clean the fish. Mm. You think? <laughs> <laughs> Another adobe cabin. Full of building materials. I think they're going to restore this one. Smoker. Back porch. Unattached. Mouse house. <laughs> Can't see through the screen. I have a bunch of adobe bricks in there. Oh, screen's loose here. Look in there. Oh. I was trying to run around. <laughs> you, you, found, you found the easy way. What does that say? KC, Kentucky Camp. Yep. Pretty heavy? Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's as heavy as concrete. 
And these walls. This thick. Just like Graterville. Same construction. Yeah. Cracking but not falling down. And this was built, um, let's see, 20, 15 years before the house in Graterville. Shingles. Chimney and... Uh, yeah. Book for a stove. Hmm. I had an attic. <laughs> That's for heat or for cooling in the summertime. And did you observe the stone wall behind you? Yes, I did. No mortar. No, just stacked up. Yep. Well, we got a hike up the hill. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.